it will be made so that it's personalized to the skill level of the person that I'm teaching. Um, I've started teaching kind of low key, uh, and I've only promoted it very, very small, but, um, let me bring the, uh, bring the, my screen back up. I've got this little, um, this little thing I threw together. I need to maybe get a little bit better about, you know, my design in them, but I just wanted to get something out there. This was a part of a, um, stream, uh, one of the, teaching streams that's uh, only available to the person because, um, you know, students can get self-conscious. Um, it's only available to the person. I am, however, going to see about maybe getting um, uh, a student on and talk about a little bit about that. But, you know, uh, and I'm just going big stupid with it. I uh, want to learn how to draw more better. You know, com. that's the kind of, I guess that's the kind of energy I like to throw off for a limited time. Art tutoring available, $60, four hours of online drawing mentorship, personalized to your skill level, plus bonus material. And over here we have a 90-minute process sketch that I did, um, which was one of the last sessions. And this was start to finish in a 90-minute session, um, explaining, going over everything we've gone over for months uh, with this student in a way that takes each individual element and... Um, and combines it into something that he can create a finished process. He can create a finished picture with a process that he builds based on these elements of process. And the basic idea is that every artist learns art backwards from what the process does. You start with composition, um, then you go into basic shapes, then you go into basic forms, then you go into more complex forms, uh, then you go into um, you know, uh, the style, uh, you know, some of that's in the shape, uh, then you go into the line art and then you go into the finished inks and then you go into colors. Mm -hmm. And, um, most people pay attention. I remember back in the early two thousands, it was really popular to have this sort of certain style of coloring, kind of an, an indie offshoot of the liquid coloring uh, studio that was so hot in the late nineties, early two thousands and colorists were being like little indie superstars and then you know you have people that want to learn how to draw the how Jim Lee draws forearms but they don't want to learn the uh the anatomy the first thing you pay attention to is the gloss the first thing you pay attention to is the surface the shiny bits um you know and then you know as you go on you say okay well how do I do the form and then as you go on you say okay well how do I break this down into basic shapes so the form is bolder then you go well, okay how do I do composition is usually the last thing that the artists do and my my um, teaching um, is based on that fundamental principle that artists learn backwards from what the process is. So I sw switch it the fuck around and I focus on process and I say the first lesson is composition. Um, the first lesson is the most important thing and it's usually the last thing people learn. Um, and that is how to block basic composition shapes to direct the eye, to provide, to, um, you know, give momentum, to give energy to a piece, to give a feel to a piece, uh, to give um, uh, a sense of urgency to uh, how the eye reacts to it and the interaction between the reader or the viewer of a piece in terms of composition. And then we go forward from there through the process. And um, I found a, I found a really tight teaching process, I think, in that. 